sucks. I don't know why they're still making a machine to do what I do. I mean, they can put a motherboard in a toaster, but they can't make like a suction cup thing to like pick up the fruit. Yeah, well, at least you don't walk behind the police horses downtown. My job doesn't even have a title. It's probably Shit Sweeper or something like that. But then again, they don't make me dress like I'm a tour guide on a riverboat. Yeah, I don't know why they make me dress like this. I do kind of have another thing lined up, though. No kidding. What is it? I don't know, I forgot I said anything. It's, it's a dumb idea. Oh, I love the angry chef. I love this guy. He, uh, he tenderizes his chicken by mocking it. You beautiful, foul piece of garbage! No, no, you don't get to just say something like that and pull out of it. Um, go on. Well, I mean, I normally wouldn't do it, but... I just sell skin grafts to pay my rent this month. Yeah, well, I dance outside of a bank on the weekends dressed as Marilyn Monroe, so I'd pretty much do anything for money at this point. You're not gonna like it, Trenton. That's never stopped me before. You can handle some deplorable ish? Alright. Can you punch a puppy in the face? That is so nectar! Are we gonna get paid for that? No, 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 just an example. Yeah, I'd have a boxer. Would you run over an old lady? Well, yeah, but I mean, if she was on like a rascal, I'd need like a truck or something. Obviously. What about taking a baseball bat to a little league team? <sighs> I knocked that out of the park. What about you? I do hate baseball, but I hate little kids even more, so definitely. So you'd farm human organs? I mean, it can't be much different than farming fruit. Okay, so we're on the same page then. Yeah. Okay. What would you do if someone offered you money to, say, kill someone? I'd be so down. Really? Fuck yeah, dude! I read books on that ish! I used to watch True TV almost as much as I watched Food Network. I'd even try to analyze it and like, try to find all the mistakes they made and stuff. Yeah, I think I know what I'm doing. So you're pretty into this stuff, then. You sound like you know what you're talking about. Yeah, I mean, it's really easy to overcook pasta, but I feel like these guys are trained professionals. No, no, I meant about the killing stuff. Oh, well, yeah, I guess that, too. <clears throat> Who are we gonna kill? Josh? No, 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 James? Wait, wait, hold on. Can we kill Trevor? Please, can we kill Trevor? Why would we kill Trevor? He's, like, the coolest dude. Yeah, but he never tells me anything, and I don't like that. I guess. So how would you... Huh? Well, it depends. If I had to get them with no witnesses, I feel like I would probably go the old strangling route. The old strangling route? Yeah, just like that flick rope. All you gotta do. Sneak up behind him, strangle him real good like. No fingerprints or nothing. Well, yeah, but what if he, like, scratches you or something? You got the skin under the fingernails. Yeah, but... Okay, that's pretty good. I got nothing. What do you got? Well, I would probably use knives. It's an obvious choice. Check this out. How long has this been there? Since the war. Anyway, stab, wipe, run. But knives, though? I feel like there's gonna be so much blood. And is that even a job, or are we just kind of bullish and around? There's a job. I just need your help planning it out. I mean, it's, you know, it's a can't-screw-it-up kind of job, you know? Okay, so let's say you needed to kill somebody. No blood, <clears throat> no witnesses. Why don't we just do the obvious and stage an accident? That's what I'm talking about. Out of accident. Let's set the scene. You clog someone's gutters on the roof. Mm -hmm. Gutters? Yeah, because then they have to like get the ladder and climb up it, and when they least expect it, bam! Knock that piece <laughs> That's the dumbest idea I've ever heard. You're gonna wait for this guy to go out there and do it? What if he hires someone else? What if he doesn't do it at all? 
How would you do it? Well, what about poison? Poison! Isn't that a woman's weapon? Well, yeah, but that's why it'd be the perfect thing. They wouldn't suspect me. I freeze the ish out of their fridge. Dude, put in a spray bottle, shake that bad boy up, get to spritzing. There is so much that could go wrong with that, though. Do you realize how much poison it takes to kill a person? Us. It's unreliable. You're unreliable. What else you got? What if, real scenario here, toaster, bathtub, an oldie, but a goodie. That is classic, but what if the core is not long enough? What if there's a power outage? What if the floor is all slick? Jesus, you are so picky. Let me guess, guns and plastic explosives are out of the equation too? Could we please just go kill them? I'm so amped right now. I'm ready to go shoot this mother fluffer, and I'll probably even have energy left to bury them when we're done. I am so ready. My entire life has been leading up to this moment. Who are we going to kill? It's perfect. See, that's the awkward part. I'm going to teach you how to make a delicious vanilla perfect. Have a great week. It's you, bro. Sorry.